Yeah, Doug and Royal, this story is generating a lot of controversy here at La Cueva. Many say this coach's actions were unprofessional, but that father tells us he did the right thing. It's a tense video that's leaving current. It's sad that people take sports that seriously and act that immature. And former La Cueva High students uncomfortable. After La Cueva's football team beat its rival El Dorado High a few weeks ago, students stormed the field even after they were told not to. Coaches tried to stop it from happening, but during the rush, La Cueva's head coach, Brandon Back, can be seen shoving a student to the ground. We showed the video to APS, and afterwards, officials put Back on paid leave so they could investigate, all while many in Albuquerque form their own opinions about what happened. I really think that people need to... to um, Remember that this is for the students and, you know, treat them with as much respect as they can. But one of the loudest voices. My son is rather lucky that I wasn't down on the field uh, helping the coaches hold the students back. Is the father of the student who was shoved to the ground. Alan Swanson says this is what his son did to the coach moments before the shove. My son's a good sized strapping young guy. Uh, didn't maybe appreciate why he was being pushed back. Uh, cursed it, coach back, and rather forcefully push coach back himself. And Swanson says he doesn't blame the coach for reacting like he did. And his response was entirely appropriate. Yet district officials will ultimately decide if coach back stepped over the line. Now, Coach Back called us a few hours ago. He says that he and his staff were only trying to protect players and students during a heated rivalry game. He also said that he has since met with the student involved and his family to clarify that the shove was not intended to hurt him. At La Cueva, Matt Howerton, KOAT Action 7 News.